Hello, everybody. This is Pahamar. And Direwolf20. And we are dying a lot in the bottom of this loaded area. Yes, this area is cheats. So, yeah. We uh, we think we got everything we needed. I think you still needed some more Orcalium. Ar yeah, that stuff. The green stuff. Yeah. So, between last episode and this episode, we managed to light up a little bit more of the area. So, and uh, we came up with this little hidey spot to quickly run into. Yep. Which has helped reduce the amount of death we have. Only a little but bit. But not totally eliminate it. Yeah, no, not even. Eep. Okay, that's so it's nice when the skeleton arrows give you a boost over obstacles so you can run away faster. Yeah, that's kind of nice. So we have some quests to hand in a minute here, but I want to get one or two more blocks of that Oracalium stuff. And there might be okay. some up here, possibly. I hear yeah. a chicken. So the Exomite seems to be on the ground level, and the green stuff is a little higher up. Yeah, I found that it's a little bit... There's actually... I thought they were glowstone lamps or something at one point, so I just was kind of ignoring them, but it's actually... There's some up here where I already lit up. So I just got a few more, which might be just enough to complete the quests. We have a lot of weird things in our AU system at the moment. Oh, are you back at the base? I am. And yes, that completes the quest rewards that we needed to do. Okay, I got us a second safe haven, I think. Sweet. Except maybe not, judging by the things in the level above me. So you know where we got the first two presses, the multi-level area? Yes. So there's more to it. Sounds less than ideal. You would be correct in that. Alright, well the good news is that I just made myself some awesome new armor. Did you save a lot in car insurance? What? Never mind. Smelting gets you three pulverizers. I'm dealing with a zombie four. horde and I'm stuck in a place I can't get back out of. Do you need help? Um, I should be able to get out of here eventually. Hey, I got a mini me lab as a great reward. And it's a, it's a new one of those spatial I.O. thingies. Oh, goodney. What was that one from? The wool? No, it was uh, like a, a bag. The wool got me Biosphere 4. I can't cool. get these zombies to stop spawning. Do you need help? They should eventually die out. They're all on fire. <laughs> you would think. I am raking in the experience. I think we should make an auto enchanter. Oh, yeah? Well, you talked about the other one that used dark steel, but we need um, quill for that. And we don't have any way of getting that. Okay. Let's see. So, yeah, there's. Um, we need what for that? I thought you said we need a quill. Uh, yes, because I believe that it needs, in, um, like, written books. So it needs the book of quills, so we need feathers. Anymore. Yeah, we have, like, literally zero feathers right now. Uh, 
what's the repair? If not, oh, blue slime is the, re is the repair. Okay, that's cool. It's kind of even better, actually. So I'm just repairing my arrows. Um, I'm making my way out of there. Okay. Yay, freedom. I'm are potentially living. Definitely. Oh, wow, living. that was good. The arrows take a little bit more to repair, though, guys. There we go. How do you repair arrows? Same way you repair all other tools. But arrows are single use. Not the um, tinker arrows. I maybe need you to make me a bow. Yeah, you probably do. That's pretty fancy armor. Can I see something? Yeah, sure. Nothing. Ha! I took zero damage from that. I'm taking fire damage, but... Nice. What armor is that? Uh, Exomite. You get three out of the four pieces from a quest, and it's just made like normal arrows, or normal armor, so. So, I guess the last thing I need to do for this, like, series of quests is this bigger on the inside thing. So, do you want to come back? I'm going to craft ourselves a personal shrinking device. Well, just a sec. I got some stuff to hand in. Okay. I got four quests. Okay. Jeez. Zombie killer. Triple compressed cookie. So I'm going to need see. two of these. I feel like I'm going to be crafting for a while here. I need two of these. So I'm going to need four basic capacitors. All right, in my reward bag, I got more pseudo round robin upgrades and more depth first search. Cool. I have to remember how to make Damascus steel. It's Tinker's Alloy Blend and Iron Dust. And now I got fancy armor too. Well done, sir. I wonder if I can straight up make this. I've probably tested this already, but nope. All right, you wanted to craft something and we'll come back? Yes. Let's come back. Well, Dyer, we've updated the Wall of Death. That's terrible. Why would you do such a thing? Because it's funny. Well, I guess so. <laughs> hey, I got a greater reward bag with a bunch of generators in it. I don't need any of them. Woot. What'd you get? Uh, let's see. Lost in time. We got this dimethyl tripotine, tripotine team, but I don't understand like what the purpose of him giving this to us because that doesn't seem to be usable for anything good. You might like this. Go on. I have a drum of salt bedrockium. Cool. With 65,536 buckets of salt in it. Okay. I don't have no idea what salt is used for. I mean, I can use this dimethyl triplotene stuff to get feathers, apparently. But it looks like it's one feather per. Oh, it's saltpeter. I have a bedrockian barrel, a drum of saltpeter. Um, cool. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this complex chemical that he gave us. Anyway, we have a new, like, we have several places we need to explore still. Um... Did I ever bring a chest down there? Kind of forget if I did this, but I kind of wanted to keep track of like what we haven't explored yet in a chest. And yes, I did that. There's the sand thing. So we've been to the biosphere. I don't think we've been to biosphere to the fourth. I think that's the new one we just got from our yes. inclusion chamber to the fourth. Have we been there? Uh, I believe that's the one we're in. Is it? Okay. We are missing amber wool. What is you are amber correct. Wool we from? are in inclusion chamber of the fourth. Miner's delight. Mini me lab. We haven't been to nether sphere. How could we forget? Reflection of space. Have we been there yet? I 
think so. I think that's the first one we went to. Rotunda. There's still something in the rotunda we need to get, by the way. And then Wild's Dream, of course. So we have Sand, Biosphere 4, Mini-Me Lab, and Reflection of Space. Where Plus we, we have cookies we could use for spatial areas. Yes. Pretty sure we've done Reflection of Space. But anyway, yeah, which was... one would you like to check out? Mini-Me Lab, Biosphere 4, or Sand? Uh, Mini-Me Lab. Okay. Are you in the spatial area? I am not. I am in the Victory Monument, putting our okay. wall out. All right. I'm taking your word for that. Apparently, piggy wool, ash wool, and smoky wool are the next ones. And then there's blank wools. Oh, that's good. Yep. So, I just replaced it with the mini-me lab. Let's see what that's all about. I love that's that you still haven't noticed that the things I put in the victory monument. What things? Nothing. I haven't been to the victory monument. Ooh, this looks fancy. Yeah, it does. This is some the kind of lab? AE related stuff. Remember, look for trophies. You look for trophies. I'm going to look for those monsters down here. Wow, this place is kind of cool looking. Is this? Okay, that's glass. This place is neat. Whoa. Right? Also, I'm really liking my new armor. There's uh, dark spots around here, eh? Okay. You're going to do something about it, right? Uh, maybe. Why don't you do something about it? I am. I just want to make sure you're doing it on your side before you cause a massive fail. Okay. I don't know what all this stuff is for. I don't know what the mini-me area is meant to be. Looks like some kind of shrine. Oh, you know what it's probably for? What's that? The mini me's. Is this where we're supposed to put them? <laughs> Maybe. You know all the mini me's we get? Oh yeah. Yeah, like they look like storage <laughs> cells for like creatures, right? So that makes sense. Yeah. Ah, derpy dire. I'm like, what's the mini me area for? Oh, it's for mini me's. <laughs> There's so many. I know. All right, that's 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 what this area is for. That explains why it's a reward bag. It's not actually anything important. It's just like, hey, that's a cool place to put all your mini me's. I don't know. There's still an awful lot of ineffable glass here. Yeah. And you know how much I love ineffable glass. I know you love it. Like, how much do we have? Are we in good shape with it or no? I'm holding on to ten. Okay. Yeah, we probably want a little bit more. Start from the very bottom, since that's where you are, and work your way up. And like, just steal like the bottom rows worth. Um, and then when you're done, we'll go check out another area. So do you want to come back after you've gotten everything? Sounds good. I'll get, okay. I'll just take two stacks, like one part of the wing. I'm just wondering why there's like applied energistic stuff in here, like cables and stuff. I think, well, there's probably something hidden. Probably. I'm hearing so many monsters. I know. They're probably outside. All right. We'll come back after Pahamar has gotten the glass he wants. And I might craft some stuff. Mr. Pahamar, how's it going? I have your mini-me. Oh boy. I'm cheating myself for fertilized dirt. That leads me to believe something's broken. Yes, the crafting recipe. Wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. I'm moving our mini-me's into the facility. But I earned us five good reward bags by completing that quest. And we have dirt that grows things very quickly, apparently. So, ooh. So are you the one like who planted I'm... the um, watermelons by chance? I pumpkins? planted the pumpkins, and I know that I planted them incorrectly. Okay. Just so you know. So let's see. I've been putting these guys in their chambers, which feels like a jail. So many mini me's. I'm gonna correct this if that's alright with you. You go for it. Okay, let's see how to fix Pahamar. It's like a tall task, I know, but. Ah. Uh.
Because once we get pumpkins, that's another quest we have to do. And then we're good. Uh, I came back here for a hoe. So what are you up to at the moment, sir? Moving mini -me's? I am. Sounds fun. We have a cell for you. Oh, we have a cell I don't like me. being in a cell. Why do I have a cell? Because it's the only way to keep you safe. Hmm. I don't know if I believe that or not. Let's see if I can find Soren. So these guys should grow, right? Now what I'm going to try, though, is the fertilized dirt. Do I have to hoe this thing or what? I guess I do. My curiosity is if the watering can stacks. <laughs> Come on, pumpkins grow. You know what we might need is some light. That'll do. There we go. That's probably what it was. Yeah, I guess with the reinforced watering can Palomar, it doesn't really matter if you have the fertilized or not. Nice. Yeah. It does it? No, it doesn't seem to. I mean, if you're using the watering can. I'm trying to keep the forge crafters together. The what? I'm trying to keep the forge crafters together in this mini-me prison. Oh, the mini-me's, right. I wonder if we have any break block breakers or train smashers. Did we get some of those? Didn't we? We did. I have a chest. I have terrain smashers. I'm just going to automate a quick pumpkin thing just for fun. Sounds fun to me at least. Sorry. I'm busy trying to sort people. Actually, what I could do. Hey, there's Slowpoke. Watch yeah, he, he needs to be sorted. Yes, he does. So that is the north direction, and we're going to make sure that that's set to extract mode. Interesting. Can't Look shift left click with my Yetta wrench on these item conduits. Is that it for Corellis? It's weird. Well, it looks like we're going to have to do with something else. Do we have any retrieval nodes by chance? Oh, there's talk. Have guns on. Nice. Do you remember if we got any retrieval nodes from uh, these things? Did. Oh, that's retrieval nodes like this. Retrieval node item. Sweet. That should work. Man, we're already down to the second level. Really? You don't want to connect to terrain smashers either. I feel like the eye-sidedness of Terrain Smashers is broken in our current version of Thermal Expansion.
All right, one more try at this. Oh, generic B. Nice. Didn't even notice him. I'm going to tell him you said that. I doubt he'll be too offended. There we go. Sweet. So Talk apparently the fertilizer, so. the fertilized ground does help when you're not ordering it. So why not? I was just thinking how nice it is a parcel to put all of his friends as capturable creatures in this game. Yeah, that was nice of him. There we go, and watering can. Sweet. All right, pumpkin quest should be completed in a few minutes, Beer Pahamar. Nice, good job. I finally got the uh, terrain smashers to connect to something that will, you know, break stuff. Yeah, we've already got 11 pumpkins. Ha ha ha. You can tell I have fun automating things. That's why I keep you around, honestly. Thank you, maybe. Also, I found out I couldn't repair my Aeon Steel pickaxe, so I had to throw a bunch of repair on it, which luckily auto-repair works. Okay, um, so what are you up to? What are you doing? I'm just about done putting all of the minimis away. Cool. I got, ooh, I got something for you, sir. What did you get me? Is it pretty? Uh, I would say so. Hey, he's wearing my skin. Sage Bachman, I see you copying me. <laughs> I also got okay. another mini-me if you want it. <laughs> what mini-me did you get? Uh, Rain Man. Who? Rain Man 11. I don't know if we have... I need to put signs up here so we know who's what. That's probably a good idea. But we have, like... We have two Sorens, we have two Algos, we have one Slowpoke, we have two each of Honeydew and Zephos. Right. We have four... Now, you have Rain Man 11, you said? Yes. We have five Rain Man 11 now. We have one Tog, one RW Tema, two Algos, two of you and two of me. Sweet. When you get up here, I have a present for you, remember? I'm just currently trying to figure out like what I need to do in terms of things and quests and such. So when you're done with that area, we should probably take a look at the next quest line, which is Lost in Time. There's a whole quest line for the Piggy Wool, and I assume that that's in the chamber that we just got. Yeah, I'm curious. Mm -hmm. Well, we see that stairwell that's got all these ME cables. Okay. Okay, I just, I wonder what's... Oh, chest. I remember now. So I'm just like curious of what's wood. all here. Because, like, oh, God. oh, I don't want to fall. I don't want to fall. Well, that didn't work out so well. I'm not having a very good time right now. Oh, no? Although I should be safe now. Okay. Thank goodness for having a working pick. Seriously? Take that and come back. Yeah, so, because I keep hearing these monsters periodically, I've been digging through the walls here to see if I could find out what's out there. And mostly it's just empty space and mobster mobs um, spawning there. Okay. But uh, I managed to get us a hacker. Hacks RS 135 cookie. What's that? It is a sextuple compressed cookie that's been renamed. Sweet. Lily pads, six cellulose, and four water. Sweet. Whew, okay, and there's a lot of minimies gone. I guess I can get rid of this ghetto little mini me enclosure.
I'm doing a little bit of mind chem. What are you chemming? I'm making lily pads. Why lily pads? Uh, it's a recipe that we need for one of the quests. Okay. I guess I should probably look at the quest book. I thought you said you had a quest ready to hand in. I'm pretty sure I do. In my reward bags, I got a Biffa's belt. Cool. 20 colored stone bricks of yellow, cyan, and magenta. Another shank. 50 chains. And another slime round shield. Not too shabby. Not at all. All right, so you think we're probably pretty close on pumpkins now? Ah, uh, we may be. Ooh, I need more clay. Did you ever get um, the uh, flexed seed thing working? Yeah, it's kind of working. We have a mature universal seed seed. Do I break it? Uh, just right click it. Now I have a rough universal seed chunk. What does that do? No idea. We have 23 pumpkins. Got an idea. Well, whatever that seed chunk is, I accidentally was getting the aluminum, so I right clicked and it planted itself. Sweet. And then I broke it and it didn't do anything. So we lost it. Oh. Resource gathering, so boring. I know. If only we had E. Well, I'm having a little bit of fun with mine cam, so I'm happy. Yes, and only if we did have a E. I can agree with that statement. I have a present for you, remember? I'm waiting. I'm like right behind you. Are you? I'm gathering like farming materials, dude. All right. You know, I'm pretty close to uh, doing something with this thing. The present, or? Yeah. I'm trying to give you a present, and you're, like, rejecting it. You haven't even gotten close to me. Um, all right. Don't come over here and accept my present. That's fine. Hold on. I'm getting you potatoes. I don't know what an imbuing station does, but I just made one. The only thing I know about it is it's involved in a quest that I just completed. It probably imbues things. It does. It's from the random things mod, and I think it has to do with the little things that fly around, the little ghost things. Oh, cool. Here. I was going to hit you with that, but... Nice. Auto smelt. It was a quest reward. Oh, it is. Cool. Yeah. Ouch. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> How much damage did that do with all your armor on? Um, I'm not did you really just throw an ender pearl at me? I did. We have like zero ender pearls, and you're like, here, let me throw one to teleport three blocks. I am nothing if not a wasteful man. <laughs> That's a fact. All right, so what do you want to do? Do you want to come back after we figure out what our next course of action is? Do you want to load up the next IO area? What do you want to do? Let's do the next I.O. area. Okay, I'm going to go load it up. Are you outside of the Ender I.O. area? I am outside of the Ender I.O. area. I have unloaded the Ender I.O. area. I can see that you've unloaded the Ender I.O. area. Our next Ender I.O. area is Biosphere to the 4th. I love how we keep calling it Ender I.O. when it's Spatial I.O. Yeah, I know. has I.O. in the name. What do you want from me? And Oh, my God. Oh. It's the Biosphere. There's cats. Oh, cats does not sound... Well, okay. I guess not terrible. Um, you'd be happy with the amount of ender lilies. Are there ender lilies But not happy in there? with the number of mobs. I agree about the mobs thing. Let me go get some ineffable glass. Oh, goodness. It's the cats that I hate. What? What do the cats do? 
So you remember those Fallen Knights? Yeah. They're from um, the same mod author as Ender.io, and he added witches that have cat pets. Why are you going wow. from shooting? I wasn't even close to where you were shooting. Why do you keep killing me? What do you think I was shooting at? I was right above it with my bow out. <laughs> why did you continue to shoot? I don't know why you were going there. There, there's horrible monsters in that room. I'm telling you right now. And I'm trying to protect you from them. I'm going to use them. some ineffable glass. Okay. I'm going to go do the lava thing. Because this is a dome, so it should be pretty easy to do the lava thing on. Not yet. Don't do it yet. I just oh. want you to, to keep killing the things near the entrance for me. Okay. I'm letting you know that the things that are near the entrance are awful. Yeah, those cats are not friendly. I want you to know that. I think I'm hitting your gravestone. You are. Okay, good. Stand back. I am standing back, sir. Holy cow. That is some awfulness right there. That looks like a heck of a kind of thing to, uh, to tackle. Watch out, I'm doing lava. And I'm making sure that we don't have monster, monsters spawn on us. Okay, good plan. This was like the last one. There was chests around the top here. This is so much worse. I wonder what kind of liquid's at the bottom of this place. Is there liquid down there? Looks like it. Oh boy. So many witches. I got some splash potions though. That's cool. So see how they throw a potion and then their cats get bigger? Yep. Why are you not wearing armor? Because I am now. Okay, good. So yeah, when they throw a potion, their cats get bigger and it's like uber buff and massive death. Yeah, there's a lot of nasty things in there. Are you um, going around the side there? Yep. Just got knocked back on my arrows, and yeah, there's definitely some stuff down there. Let me see what the um, book has to say about this area. So we should be finding some Kalendrite blocks and Amordrine blocks. Sounds like we get Calendrite and we have to use it to make Armordyne with shiny metal. That sounds really not good. Um, cool. You right there? I'm withered, but I'm okay. I too am with it. I 
I mean, it's reasonable to assume that if this is some kind of mirror of the previous world, that um, the the location of the big box with the wool in it is going to be about the same, which is right down there somewhere. Mm hmm. All right. I made us another way to get in and out. Cool. Good plan, sir. I'm digging uh, downwards. I can see that. Yeah, that's definitely some kind of molten metal. And there is definitely a um, box. Yeah, you don't want to get into that molten metal, by the way. I know it doesn't sound like it, but molten metal is hot. You have your magnet on? Yeah, you realize how bad you are at making stairs. Um, you know, I'm tolerable. You should know that my pick does like insta break. I have learned that now. So it's really hard to make stairs. I'm glad you were selected for the stair job. Thanks. I'm glad you voted Direwolf on the stair job platform. I mean, you only have yourself to blame. Right? I can't be I can't be blamed if you make fancy campaign promises. I well, look, there's only two of us on this map and clearly you voted for me cuz no one else did. So you only have yourself. I to could play. have abstained. You could have, but you didn't. So I've got six calendrite blocks. So that's good. How many I do you have? have the five. Box? Yeah. Okay. We have ten. And you're right. I see what's probably and there's the a cat. What's that? There's a cat on top. There was a cat on top. Molten calendrite is what that is. As a matter of fact, I think I have a, um, I think I got some ender pumps as our quest reward at some point. Got your back, Pahamar. And a piggy wool. And there's a piggy nice. here. We, I think, did a good job. I see a chest in the distance, by the way. There's one right here, too, with an epic reward bag. Nice. I'm going to go for that one. I'm getting more of this uh, metal block. There's dense calendrite ore in here and like a calendrite florb, so that's kind of cool. Uh, calendrite large plate, calendrite broadhead axe pattern, sword blade, scythe head. Where did you go? Over here. Oh, that's withering dust. I probably want to hang on to that. Where'd you get over there? I built. You build? I do a good job of building, but I'm not being harassed. I think we have all the calendrite we'll ever need. Are you sure? No. But we have a lot of it. I was going to say, that's a that's a pretty loaded statement. I know. Do you want to head back to the observatory and sort through our loots and come back? 
Yeah, we could probably do that. Okay, and then we'll have to figure out if there's any way to get in and get those ender pearl plants, because I would really like them. And I hope he was smart enough to put ender cores in there. That would be like the best thing ever. But if he didn't, that means we have to make them and that will hurt. Okay, back in a minute, guys. We back? Hey, Dire Wolf, I'm back. Oh, I got a legendary reward bag, by the way. Wow, that's some cool looking armor. What'd you get? Whoa, hello. In my, oh yeah, in my, uh, in my epic bag, I got as a redstone furnace resonant, a pulverizer resonant, resonant, I can't talk, I'm just so excited, sawmill resonant, indu induction smelter resonant, magma crucible, fluid transposer, and glacial precipitator. Look what Ooh. I got. Fancy. Like, if I give you the sword, will you promise to give it back? Yes. I just want you to see what's on that sword. Wither, Decay X, Health Draining X, Sharpness X, Water X Coded, and Tetrodo... <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> but it sounds cool. Damage. That's a one shot. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right, you are now the melee class. I am. And the ranged class. Where did you get that from? Legendary reward bag. Like, that's what a legendary reward is supposed to be. That is awesome. I need to kill more Wither Witches, by the way, for one of these quests. Oh, so, why did I get that? Oh, the bedrock. All right, my legendary reward is 64 diamond spikes, Yeah. diamond horse armor, 64 dense diamond ore, and 64 bedrock. Cool. And five Nemo fish. Be really careful with bedrock, because, like, you can't put that back. Like, you can't... I've I've gathered that. <laughs> to the Victory Monument. Oh! So, uh, I guess that's about wrapping up point for this episode, though, huh? Yeah, so we also got the New Age Minor Delight Hypercubed. Yay, there's Victory Monuments in here. Yep, so all the trophies, all the wall. Oh, cool, there's some walruses. <laughs> I put those, like, four episodes back. I was wondering when you were going to notice them. Yeah, because I go to the Victory Monument a lot. You should. It's a I cool should. place. It is a cool place, but, you know, I'm busy, like, making us survive. Oh, oh, there's a block in there we still need. A more drying. Why aren't these slimy leaves dropping? Oh, well, I'm not worried too much about it. Pumpkin 58. All right, we almost have pumpkins. What, what? We have 59 pumpkins now. I can actually probably complete this pumpkin quest now. In like oh, actually, seconds. we can. Um, we have one more quest we can do. Oh. Just a sec. I just completed the farming one. Superb farmer. Sheep, cow, and chickens. I can spawn up some chickens now. We can get feathers. Perfect, because one of the quests that we needed to do was for the enchanter. Nice. Did you complete that one? Is that what you're saying? Or I did. Oh, you already made the enchanter? Yeah, because I already oh, had wow. all the materials from like four episodes ago. Sweet. Good job, Pahimar. Three greater reward bags. Uh, two flasks of withering, five player cores, and five obsidian sticks. Cool. Five augment space-time flux unifiers, and four quadruple compressed cookies. Oh, wow. Um, that's cool. All right, I think it's time to wrap up the episode, buddy. I think so, too. Today's been a long one. It has, but it's been a good one. The best. It's, you know, up there. Yeah, I no, I'm uh, I'm really excited about my armor that I got, which, by the way, has, like, Fire Protection 10 on most of it and Flim Flam 10 on one of them. So do yourself a favor and don't hit me. <laughs> okay. Or you'll get Flim Flammed, and I promise you will not enjoy that experience. The flimming and the flaming. I mean, it's not horrible, but it's definitely something you probably don't want any part of. I want to go stand in lava and see if it hurts. Guess what? It does not. 
So now you can totally just go down there and kill everything with impunity? Uh, for the most part. Let's I mean, uh, I still take damage from do that from before we wrap up the episode. No, I still take damage from things. I definitely still take damage from things. I just don't seem to take any fire damage. Hey, at least you gotta say that the new way to get into this area is so much more safe. Also, uh, this sword's still not as good as my bow. <laughs> just in case you were wondering. Well, now I know. Your bow is just the god of gods. Yeah, it's a pretty good bow. Alright, guys. Daryl20 and Pahamar signing off. Hope you enjoyed the episode. I'm sure there will be new more the shenanigans super coming long up soon. Episode. Yeah, we did actually kind of run long this time, didn't we? This is almost a two-parter. You know, it is almost a two-parter. But we'll stick to one because we like you guys. Aww. All right, guys. Take it easy. See you guys.